Who would prefer drunk dancers? So here he goes. First, this isn't a remote world. It's Mars. You never left Mars? What? So we got the compound. Some things need protection. Uh, protecting. <laughs> protection. <laughs> Dr. Saloy, there is a buried device or artifact on this world. The device is broadcasting a weak signal using a known protocol containing an ID and metadata. The metadata is indicative of an information storage device containing encrypted data. The holy language of the ancients. Much as you are a holy va <laughs> Much as you are holy and this vessel is holy, the cache is also holy. Oh, oh my god. Holy! Tongue tidy tidy tongue. We must retrieve. Praise be the founders. Oh! Hello, hello, how you? I am good. I am playing Crypt World 4 tonight. Sentry drones detected, used only to protect high value assets. Defense only, establish base of operations and conduct assault. Units within range of sentry drone will be destroyed. Destroy sentry drones from a distance with snipers. Thanks, Sarge. I'll exercise extreme sniper caution. Okay, so these are like those weird out uh, explody drones in Cripple 3. Sad have I been. Our actions have not been in accordance with peaceful intentions. I know things must be done that must have been. But we should always consider alternatives. For that, I have added and decrypt messengers with our abilities. They are bombers, but with better message. We are different, yet the same. Use these and decrypt messengers, and we may yet establish a dialogue. Go in peace, Traveller. Anti-crit bombers, hip, they might just do that. Okay, Larry. Bye, have a good night. You love this level. Is it difficult? Is it, uh, uh, it mentioned uh, exploding drone thing, which it reminds me of these drones in Crip World 3 where if you got too close to them, they'd shoot this beam at your turrets and then both would die, the drone and the turret. So I need to start... Oh, we got blue white crystals here. I think I am going to start here just because it gives me access to that. So build you there. Put you there and now we start spreading. Yoink. Okay, time to play. So what will happen now? With the universe suddenly implode, destroying all life as we know it. Taking us and the creeper out with it. Do do do. Okay. Got you, get the factory down, because I'm gonna need you. Get myself a couple miners. Do do do. Do do do. Cancel, like, tell some of them. Oh, I can't tell them to stop can Oh, no, no. If I do that, it should stop charging them. Can be tricky, but once you get a good sniper set up, it gets easier. I should actually probably get a sniper or two there, just in case. Because they're going to spread pretty quick. Hey, they even look kind of like those exploding drones of Creeper World 3. Some terps. Okay, more power. And while we're at it, let's go get some sprayers. Okay. You there, you there. You there. You there. You there. You there. Just chew up all my power. <laughs> missile here and missile here. Okay. Moo! Hello, blue cow! Luckily, the sentry drones stay on the track. The blobs can be a real nuisance. Oh, you mean this track here, so they don't actually come to me. Okay, that's actually a lot nicer then. Because I thought they'd uh, follow the digitalis like they did in the previous game. Every time I play Crypto 4, I hear praise be the founders and go, Oh! <laughs> then be <laughs> wearing rub. <laughs> but it's praise me the founders. How could you not go all uh oh holy messenger on it? Oh, 
Okay. Now I need to start spreading this way. They are getting into the good stuff though, so let's put you there. Put you there and there. Has more power to the north. Yeah, I'm hoping to get power up there. I'm gonna send you over to here because these guys have lots of stuff over here. We'll uh, start spreading this way and hopefully uh, cut that creeper off before it starts spreading too far. Otherwise, then I won't be able to. Uh, you know, then I'll have, uh, they'll start destroying that that trees and trees are extra power. Do 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 do. Okay, so miner here. Bring you there and bring you there. Preacher is easily my favorite character in this game, even though Preacher's. <laughs> I know, eh? Preacher is really bad spelling. But he's also so quirky. Okay, we've now got urns. Oh no, uh, I didn't get any missiles over here. If they launch over here, I'm in trouble. Put a sniper here. Sniper here. Missile. Missile. I did not build any snipers here either, which was extremely smart of me. Uh, power is holding out. Okay, you can go always on. Doesn't care if I get. Ah. Uh, did that spray just self destruct or is it just me? It was just sitting there, I told it to turn always on, and then boom, it's dead. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, put the urn down. And now, for the best part, the bombers. Are you sure Preacher isn't corky? Just kidding. <laughs> AC bombers are going to go yoink, 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 yoink. We'll put uh, normal bombers on one side and AC bombers on the other side. Okay, power is going great, but I'm going to need some blue eye, more blue eye if I'm going to have bombers, so... Let's put you to blue eye. And with that done, I now need... Fire rate, fire range. Should I get energy collection or mine production? Mine production would mean more blue eye, so... Yeah, let's go with that. And energy collection too. How much does that leave spare? Another four spare? Hell yeah. Okay, so. Defenses are up. Everything's great. They can't hurt me. I am safe. Just building a few more snipers because there seem to be a lot of uh, exploding things. Now I can start pushing forwards. So... It certainly takes a while to get shot down, doesn't it? It's right in the middle of my base, but they don't shoot it until it gets low enough. It's like, gee, sure you're cutting it close enough? Uh, let's get, get uh, normal bombers, because the AC bombers somehow built before the runway did. But they will take a while before they're full. Actually, how long does it take to fill these things up? Are they full right now? I think they are full, so I could go like grab them now and just tell them like run that way once, right? And now just fill this whole area with a whole bunch of anti creep. 
What in the world is- Oh wait, that's where they're spawning from, isn't it? So how much anti-crypt do these guys deploy for me? It looks like they deploy a lot of anti-creep. Holy crap! That is a lot of anti-creep! I mean, I know I wanted anti-creep down here, but I wasn't expecting that much! Things like the sniper shooting sound is like X-Wings in Star Wars. So get sniper here to protect me, sniper there to protect me, and a missile here. The reason I wanted my turf over here is because I'm going to go and uh, terraform this. Go give you about high, that high, and give myself some more room to play with. I'm going to go you build on top of here and use this as like a sniping area to shoot these things down. To make sure they can't hurt me. That didn't take very long for the bombers to fly again, did it? Okay, so clearly I see. I know, eh? In the other game, it's like it takes them forever to load up with fuel, but this time it's like, look, they're already almost full again. Holy crap! I love these AC bombers. They are so much better. I mean, they were all right in the previous game, but half the time they felt. Pretty useless, if you know what I mean. But now it's like they're so overpowered. Look, they'll fly up again and they just fill up with more anti creep. The sprayer feels kind of useless to me compared to these bombers. Look, there they go again! <laughs> yeah, let's go grab these guys now. Yoink, 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 yoink. Uh, exactly what I did. <laughs> Do you think these guys can be killed by these? I don't know, let's give it a test. I'm going to go tell you guys to just go here. If you all die, you all die. If you live, you live. Mind you, I actually wonder how deep the creep actually is. Yeah, it is pretty shallow, isn't it? Uh, where is it? 1.9 compared to 2. So they're about equal height over here. The anti-creep is fighting equally with the creep. So the drones are not assassinating my bombers. That's awesome. And use three normal bombers on each emitter to nearly lock them down. Really? Just love the. Uh, the uh, at first, I wasn't too sure about you know the whole airstrip. I think the runway thing because you know it takes up a whole lot more space and then you got build bombers and all that alongside of it But it feels like uh, he's gonna made them a significantly more powerful than they were in the previous game because in the previous game They were all right, you know, they did their job But at the same time it also felt kind of like they were underpowered and they cost too much to run It's just it didn't feel like it was worth using things like bombers and stuff this time it's like, look at them go! They're, they are doing everything for me! I don't have to do anything! Okay, I'm gonna go and give you an urn. So that way I can get you up there and you can uh, snipe the living crap out of everything. I do not know how much range these guys have. I wanna be very careful. Get another sniper. Okay, what range you got? Whoa, nice. I might have a second one of these. Just so that way I can uh, have a nice... Whoa, look at him go! Smart ass alert, except you have to build them, supply them with AC so they don't do everything for you. <laughs> <gasps> That's true. Now let's bring you guys up this way now. Because I... 
we'll use this area too as a staging area. I won't give like super powered snipers, but you know, just having snipers there prevents them from like coming down and attacking me. Actually, I might not even need two snipers here, I might only need one. Like once that area is all done, I'll, I might just, you know, send my uh, super sniper up that way. Yoink. Yoink. I know, I, they're so overpowered, these super snipers. It's just listen to all those sounds, the snipers, the bombers, it's just... This map is going nuts. <laughs> Pew 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 bang bang <laughs> Just a mix of all sorts of dangerous sounds and they're all my danger sounds Hey, what was that sound? I just heard what sounded like a rocket or something What is that sound? Is that the drones making that sound? I don't know Bring you forwards, bring you forwards. Okay, I think I can now safely start moving across to here. Yep, okay, I can. So I'm gonna go and nullify you. Missile, missile. It's getting dangerous. Sniper, sniper. Sniper, snipe. Sun sounds mean. I think those drones are trying to shoot me. <laughs> yeah, this sound, a song is pretty calming, isn't it? Okay. What do I want to do next? I want to. I could get a micro rift because it does feel like I'm taking a while to push forwards. Like I can get a micro rift here, so that way I can get my resources a lot faster. So, hey, what in the world is this? Is this like an area which it, it powers up? Like it can only, I don't know. Oh, wait, is that? Oh, wait, no, that's a beacon. Oh crap, I built a beacon. <laughs> the sad soft. Uh oh. They got in. How did they get in? Whoa, look at all this anti creepy here. Okay, let's tell these bombers to change their. Uh... You guys are gonna bomb here. You guys are going to bomb. Here. Let's also change some of you guys now because there's plenty of destroyed creep, so let's get you guys go like that. Yoink. Yoink. Put you there. Put you there. 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 Going great. Your anti production that could cause. Oh, okay. Power problems. How is it that they're getting me here? Tell some of my anti creep bombers to go right here. Why? Hmm. Nullify here. Oh, 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 I forgot about that. 
bring you no grab you and put you there that should prevent anyone from coming that way so you're protecting me from that way you're protecting me from that way and that should hopefully keep me safe from the drones So why is no one covering this area with Andy Creep? Okay, there's Andy Creep there. It looks fine to me. Okay, they just took their sweet time to do it. Ah dang it, there goes that nullifier again. Put you there. A few mortars there. There is a lot of weird sounds in this map. I'm wondering if these drones are always making the sounds. Okay, let's push you guys forwards. Because it looks like I'm going to need you guys to capture whatever that is. Creep just knock out one of my airplanes? I'm not sure. Okay. Put a micro rift here. Did I not get that micro rift there? You're disabled. Let's try this again. Put you there. And hopefully you can stop being a pain in the butt. Okay, you're under control. Let's head that way now. Well, oh, actually, why don't I grab you, put you... Say... Do you guys hear all those now noises that they're making? What is making those noises? Terraform. Shrink you down. Change height to there. What died? Pylon. Where is said pylon? Right there. Okay. You there, you there. There. Come on, don't get it. Okay, you're fine. Oh, it must be eggs popping that's doing it. Start grabbing some of these bombers and telling them to come out away from there because they don't need to be there anymore. Nice. you to there and mortar 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 just to make sure that nothing like pushes its way across something died don't know what oh whoops meant to go a higher height here Missile launcher destroyed. You're right there. Okay. Put you down. And now you can safely go there, hopefully, and not die. Oh, locked up. 
I hate it when my game locks up. Luckily, it'll only be a 5 to 10 second freeze. My computer has been doing that a lot lately. I might need to uh, restore my computer, you know, from scratch. Might fix whatever's causing it. Okay, uh, you... Actually, no, let's move you there and put you there. How about you have a nice radius defend me? I have some urns, so let's go put you on there. And bring you over. Let's also start grabbing these back guys. They don't need to be all the way back there. Not anymore, at least. Okay. Next thing I need to do is... Wait, why is that not charging? I have... Oh, wait, I forgot to... <laughs> I forgot to go and build the refineries. My mistake. Wait, does that mean I wasn't building the micro... No, no, they don't use green. bombers for me bloop 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 okay so we're gonna go get in here now we're gonna go and uh, nullify you so you can't co okay I would nullify you except I can't reach you I may have to resort to terraforming. That should get close enough, right? Yoink. Yoink. What the hell is that noise? It's like... Pew, pew. Is that the drones trying to kill something? But they can't get close to me, can they? I don't honestly know what's making that noise. Uh, I get you. Terraform. You go down that way. Yay, force field's going up now. I put you there. Hopefully that gets you even. Yeah, that gets you even radius of that thing, so you can keep them silent to the moment they spawn. If I put you there. That protects against both of them. Even better. Okay. Um, that creep is where you're sitting. Move, 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 move. Get off the creep. Okay, back again. Oh god, I need another micro rift here. These micro rifts feel too OP, you know what I mean? It's like, why would you need a turret when you have a micro rift? Hey, Dave, how are you? I mean, why would you need a portal when you have a micro rift? That's what I meant to say. Okay, got you there. Start pushing forwards. I am doing great. I am playing Creep World 3 and talking to people. I like talking to people. 
keeps the depression away. <laughs> You there? Okay, you're keeping on top of everything now. So, let's grab AC bombers. You guys are gonna go and say, let's go cut across like so. Crib oh, did I say crib of four? I uh, three. I'm so used to playing Crimson Wars 3 that I completely forget that this is number 4! <laughs> what died? Uh, nullifier died, okay. Where did I put the nullifier anyway? Oh, there did I put it, okay. Nullifier, you there. Go put a cannon there just to make sure that doesn't happen a second time. Okay, snipers are making sure they can't leave their little bat caves. For some reason I haven't received this- oh, I know why. It's because uh, that's filled with creep. Grab you and let's fill you up with anti-creep. Let's bring you over this way. You shall be silent soon. So let's grab some turrets. You there. You there. You there. You there. I'll put you there and I'll put you there. So what's the objective? Nullify enemies, collect items, activate totems. Easy peasy. But I almost finished doing everything really. The enemy is all under control now. Actually, am I able to nullify these guys before they start toasting my buildings? Yoink. Oh, well, let's see. put another sniper here because those blob nests hurt. Missile here. Missile there. Missile there. Somehow that I still haven't grabbed that so... Terraform height. Why have I not? Why have I not grabbed that yet? Okay, let's increase this radius. Maybe that'll fix it. Okay, now, nullify you. Grab you, because you're mine now. Bring you up that way. Can I fit anything? No, I can't fit anything there. Just have to move my uh, forces upwards. Yay, you're nullified! And hopefully you'll stay nullified. Put you there. I find the graphics are so much different to Creeper 4 and Creeper 3. A hard time mixing. <laughs> well, it's more that I'm so used to playing Creeper World 3 that when I'm just playing a Creeper World, uh, I, you know, automatically say Creeper World 3. But yeah, I know what you mean. They're pretty obvious different games. At the same time, you know, they're still creep world, so when you say one, you kind of mean, and, you know, you accidentally say the other. Okay, totem's done. Item is still not collected, so while we wait for that to get collected, we'll just start nullifying the enemies. Put you there, put you there. Put you there. Now, nullify here. Oh, that's why I'm having trouble there. Eggs. Everyone loves eggs.
I can start pushing this way and I can nullify you. I can nullify whatever the heck you are in a moment. I cannot remember what you are for the life of me. Something died, what is it? Cannon destroyed. More cannon. Wait, wasn't that there a second ago? I just sworn it was still there. These bloody eggs are the problem. Oh wait, that's a stash there. Nullify. Get rid of you. You there. Actually, why don't I go get my last urn and put you over there? Do I have any spare urns? Yeah, here he comes. Nullify was destroyed. This micro rift is here, but it's not doing anything. See, everything is coming this way. Unless I didn't build another micro rift over here. Oh. <laughs> well, that explains that. <laughs> that explains that a lot. <laughs> okay. There you go. Go. You there? Yoink! 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 Get you up. And you nullify there. You're fine. You nullify there. Let's bring you up this way now. Nullify. How did I still haven't got this thing? Did I do something wrong? I mean, I'm lowering myself to minimum. I don't know. I should have another turps around here or something. There it is. To speed up their mining. Bring you there. Bring you there. 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 Incoming spore. And then nullify. Okay, there ain't not much left to nullify, is there? Eggs. Exactly. Put you there. You there. You there. Clear out the creep from that way so I can nullify that area. You there? Put you there? It's fine. Put you there? And nullify there, okay. Uh oh. Nullify there. 
Oh, you are ahead of me at the storyline again. <laughs> Have I still not captured this thing? Let's build some more turps. I should have captured that by now. Looks like an easy level. Uh, I've been at this level for like half an hour, I have. But yeah, this level was pretty easy and tons of fun too. Anti creep bombers are awesome. Okay. So somehow I still haven't got this. So I still haven't won. Hopefully all these extra turrets will make the difference. And there's got to be something I'm doing wrong, right? Why I haven't won yet? Or it could just be that I haven't built a tower that would power it up. <laughs> it could be that. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> Data encrypted. Authorized access only. Added decryption passphrase. Challenge. Hey kid, did you ever actually purge that system cache? Not sure your grandfather would approve of such sloppy work. How? What? Director Hale! Uh, passphrase. Die Harold is an idiot. <laughs> Doctor. Oh, Dr. Hale is an idiot! <laughs> decryption key valid. Cache data dump follows. Hey kid, guess you're wondering how a message from good old Doc Director Hale ended up in an alien info cache on a strange and remote world. I always prefer direct answers, so here it goes. First, this isn't a remote world, it's Mars. You never left Mars? What? Absolutely incredible. All these worlds were Mars? Yes, I know each world you have visited has appeared different from the last. It's because you have been hopping through time, not space. With each rift jump, the rift engine is a flaw. There's a compensation factor that is necessary. All the details are in this info cache. It will be a simple integration. Millions of years later, Director Hale has given me stuff to do. I know, eh? It's like, this has all been mods the whole time? Holy crap! What's important for you to know is that we came after you. After those meteor strikes and the creeper arrived, we took shelter underground and survived. Once you jumped, the creeper disappeared as fast as it arrived. I'm sure you've encountered terrible amounts of creeper in your travels so far. That's awesome! Surviving was enough. You didn't have to come after me. The Great Rift Engine. <laughs> we rebuilt the program after you left, built a new jump vessel and came after you, or so we fought. We too jumped through time. Each time we landed in what we thought was a new world, but eventually we came to realize it was Mars at different ages. To many jumps we landed in a time where Mars was populated. This, it would turn out, was an incredible stroke of luck. Of course you would. You are always a lucky one. You see, the history of our galaxy is that, that civilizations emerge. Human civilizations. Each grows to a greatness in one form or another. Then the creeper arrives and destroys almost everything. Then there is a period of chaos and desolation. The random survivors on a few scattered worlds slowly rebuild civilization over millennia. Sometimes they start from the Stone Age. These periods of darkness are long and periods of galactic civilizations are always very short. Creeper seems drawn to complexity. So once the civilization is vast and complete, the Creeper culls it. <laughs> That's horrible! Extendable travels through time instead of space. It's different, eh? So to land in a time with a civilization at its peak is one in a million. Event, but land in one we did. We learned much from the people of that time. We learned about the flora in our rift engine and that it seemed like an intentional design. You can thank your grandfather for that, I presume. Yeah, I bet we can. We learned about the history of the people we came to know, but more importantly, they learned from us. We were from what they called the origin world, Earth. For them, it was a myth. Little did they know, Earth was the third planet in their very system we arrived in. Word quickly spread of our arrival. Scientists came from all across the galaxy to study and talk with us. Our biology, our historical records, our technology, once they studied us, they were able to piece together the story of the galaxy. They weren't the second civilization. There were hundreds of galactic civilizations before them, each leaving scattered ruins. But I digress! So that must mean all these versions of Mars I've visited were the ruins of some cold civilization. Kid, we looked for you, but it became clear we would never catch you. Each jump we took always put us behind you in the temporal timeline. So we did the next best thing. We created this info cache and placed it here on Mars. We built this compound to protect it for as long as possible. We knew in time the creeper would come, 
but we'll learn that some things would survive the creeper, and we hope this would be one. It's the best bet we could do. If you were reading these words, it worked. You always found a way to get the job done. Why would this be any different? The important is that what you do now. You have a choice. You should have arrived after the fall of my civilization. How long it has been, I can't know for sure. But you were in a desert between civilizations. So your choices are, you can create your rift engine and stop hopping through time, or you can keep jumping through time and take your chances with what you might find. Perhaps you too will eventually, find la uh -huh, eventually land in the civilization near its peak. Those are wonderful choices. Going home isn't one of the options. So I'm sure you are thinking going home isn't one of the options. Yeah, that's right. Best you can do is make a new home. I'm long gone. Everyone you know has been gone for countless years. Everything that mattered to hundreds of galactic generations is gone. Okay, but there has to be one more thing. Director Hell always had a one more thing to consider. <laughs> one more thing. If you do decide to stay in this time, there might be a way to shorten your interim till the next civilization and give the survivors a leg up against the creeper. It won't matter for you, but for whatever civilization comes next, it could make a big difference. <laughs> yeah, Director knew, Hell knew I liked this challenge. I left info caches on three other worlds. Combined, they contain the sum total of everything this civilization learned. They contain the knowledge of history of galactic civilizations, and we know it. But this knowledge of emergent civilization could better prepare itself for what would eventually come. Perhaps they would eventually learn what, what the true purpose of the creeper is and where it originates. Sounds like something worth doing. The caches are separated in Oh my god, this is getting long, ain't it? Caches are separated in on three other worlds. Too much in one place, and the cripple would have taken it. Coordinates of these worlds are included in this info cache. If you should take up this challenge, you will need to copy the info caches and then visit as many other worlds as possible. Seed each world with a copy of the caches. Help any survivors you might find. In time, even one of your caches is found, it could make a difference for the civilization to come. I'm on it, you know what I chose. You always knew. Lastly, Danu, never had children, but you'll always be my kid. Now, go get to it. Yes, sir, I'll make you proud. <laughs> and yet you're still calling him an idiot. <laughs> okay, last thing I need to do. That is nullify you and then I can leave. What's that bombing? Th is that these guys making that? No, they're silent, so the other ones are making the bombing noise. Nullify you, and then we're done. Cool, okay, next mission. Just listen to all those sounds, the snipers, the bombers, it's just... This map is going nuts! <laughs> pew pew pew, boo pew pew, pew pew, bang bang! <laughs> just a mix of all sorts of dangerous sounds. And they're all my dangerous sounds.